This is WSJV, Channel 28, Elkhart, South Bend. From South Bend, Elkhart, this is Michiana Tonight from Newswatch 28. And Koenig's weather, Jim Squirkin with sports, Ann Nyberg and Bruce Dunbar with news of our region. Regular viewers of Newswatch may have noticed that we're doing things a bit differently tonight. We've moved into new quarters here at TV 28, and we hope you like it. If you do, tell your friends. If you don't, tell us. Either way, we'd like to hear from you. Address your remarks to News Director Dan French here at TV 28. One of the new additions to our newscast is Ann Koenig, who will be doing the weather for us. Welcome, Ann. Thank you, Bruce. It's nice to have you here. What's the weather look like? I really feel good bringing you this news. It's going to be warming up a little bit tomorrow, and I look forward to bringing you more good news. That's outstanding. Great way to start. We'll be back in a moment. The Good evening, everyone. Let's take a look at what is happening right now. Currently, we have cloudy skies. Our temperature is 59 degrees. The relative humidity stands at 87 percent. Barometric pressure, 29.98 inches of mercury. Winds are out of the northwest at 8 miles per hour. Now let's take a look at today. Our high today is 61 degrees, which came around 2 and 3 this afternoon. Our low, 58 at 1 and 2 this morning. Our record high for this date, 87 degrees back in 1954. Our record low, 34 in 1942. Looking at our rainfall for today, 13 hundredths of an inch for the year, 31.57. Our normal is 27.66. We are above normal, 3 and 78 hundredths of an inch of rain. Now let's take a look at our national map and see what's happening elsewhere. As we can see out west today, showers in Northern California, 49 in Seattle, snow in the Northern Rockies. In Las Vegas today, hail, and they actually had winds that gusted up to 60 miles per hour, 79 in Phoenix, 63 in St. Louis, 90 in southern Texas today, heavy rain along the Florida Peninsula, clear and cool along the Gulf Coast, also rain which extended from Ohio all the way up to the northern tip of Maine, and 57 in Caribou today. Now let's take a look at our satellite map. A large mass of clouds continued to develop over the central and northern Rockies with a developing storm. Snow in the higher mountains has been developing from this system. A low pressure system continues to give cloudy skies over the Ohio Valley. Thunderstorms continue from just south of New England to the Florida coastal waters. Now let's take a look at our regional map. 67 today in Chicago, 61 in Detroit, down in Cincinnati, 62 degrees. And now for a look closer to home in southern Indiana. Evansville tonight checking in with 67 degrees, Indianapolis 63, Fort Wayne 61, and closer to home here in the South Bend Elkhart area, 59 degrees. Now let's take a look at our forecast for tonight. Clearing and cool, patchy dense fog will be developing late. The low will be around 50 degrees. The winds will be light and variable. Looking at tomorrow, becoming mostly sunny and warm. The high will be in the low to mid-70s. Winds will be southeast 5 to 10 miles per hour. For tomorrow evening, it will be fair and cool. To me, that's good news. The low will be in the upper 40s to the low 50s. So, Bruce, I don't think we really can complain. I know we've had a lot of rain the past couple of days, but it will be clearing up. Well, that's great, Ann. That's, that's a good weather forecast for your first one here. I Here's feel Watch good bringing you this good news. <laughs> All right, great. Anytime. My dad will take good care of you like he takes good care of me. See the best of the lives, yes. Are the best for the best? Well, that's it for newscast number one in the new look of Newswatch. We'll be adding some new features along the way. We've already welcomed Ann Koenig to the Newswatch team. Ann is an Elkhart native, a graduate of Concord High, and she'll be here with the weather on the early and late Newswatch. Ann Nyberg and Jim Skorkin and myself will hang around as well. We sincerely hope you like what you see. Let us know what you think by dropping News Director Dan French a note. And stay with us here throughout the coming months for an even better Newswatch. Good night. This has been Michiana Tonight from Newswatch 28. Join us again at 10, 11 in Michigan for Michiana Update.